You already know this is your boy Mo from Mo's Auto Clinic where we do the best to pay for very full prices for you guys. This is part two of the headlight restoration. So I just want to show you, um, I don't use it very much, but I found a bottle. So I said, why not? Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to this video, guys. We work really hard to get to these videos for you guys. And I do my best to, you know, make this work for you guys. So um, this is a... This is not an advertisement video. I don't advertise for anybody, okay? I'm not sponsored by anybody or any of that. So just wanna put that on, on the record. This is not a uh, advertisement video or anything. So this is a, a chemical that we actually used to use uh, in a dealership in Volvo. It's pretty good chemical. It's, it's pretty much clear coat in a can. So um, after doing the 1200 guys and making it look like this, okay? It has to look like this somewhat smoother or it won't work. But once you make it like this, you gotta take your taping out, your old taping, and put some new tape and wipe wipe down pretty good. And um, we're not done with the taping yet, but we're just giving you an example for right now. Uh, once you wipe it down, we used uh, all prep stuff that we used before we paint is very, very good. Again, guys, this is not an advertisement video. This is just the stuff that I use here. Um, this stuff is like really, really strong. Um, it removes wax, grease, um, all that, and it really, really works. Uh, it's really good stuff. So once we wipe it down a couple times with the all prep, um, and it looks like this, somewhat shine. So I'm going to put the camera down, guys, and I hope it shows. But I'm going to put the camera down and show you now what it's going to look like at the finished product. Um, I try to make it in two videos, so I hope this will work for you guys. Again, we work really hard, guys, so please don't forget to like and subscribe to our video. So I'm just going to put the camera down and show you guys what this little bottle could do. I think this is good enough. I'm not sure. But I think it really good. Now we're going to use more tape. To get more coverage. Because we don't want this stuff getting on the paint. And actually guys, this is again showing you how to take kind of like doesn't have to be perfect. You just want to get the panel covered up. So take it real well. Hopefully I got enough. So that's what happens when you use old stuff. It doesn't come out your way, but we're gonna fix that. Try to fix it. Hopefully, we could fix it.
And voila! Wham! Wham! Damn near brand new, huh? So here's that. That's how you kind of... I should have prepped more guys, you know, covering up more, but it worked out for me because, you know, I've been doing it for a while, so I know how to get around stuff like that. But this is how you do hairline restriction, guys. Um, I will wait a little bit for the tape, you know, for that clear coat to dry around the tape and then take the tape out. But please, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. This is how you do a proper, proper hair light restriction. With the spray gun, it's always better. But this is how you do this, guys.